What's up Elite Nation, my name is Rob Beer, we're here at the compound. Uh, today we're going to talk about pull-ups. So we're starting to see somewhat of a recurring theme in potential clients in our assessment phases. My goal is I just want to be able to do one bodyweight pull-up. Okay, easy enough seems like, but a lot of people aren't capable of pulling this off just yet. So we're going to talk about a linear progression on how we're going to get to there. Okay, so instead of just trying pull-ups, failing over and over, we want to get a couple wins in there first. So how we're going to do that is take away some of the effects of gravity on the body and we're going to start with an inverted row from an incline. Okay? So what we're going to do is use the rack and a barbell. We're going to tuck under here and keep the elbows in nice and close. Shoulders back, pull in from there. Okay? Shoulders back and down at the top. That's the key. So you get full extension at the top. Right? Tuck in here, core nice and tight. All the way down. Shoulders, elbows in tight, shoulders back and down to the top. Okay? Stage one. So once you can get enough of those done, you want to progress a little bit, we're going to take away some of the stability of the bar and actually work off the rings. Okay? So it's going to be the exact same premise as we just talked about on the rings. Here, core nice and tight, elbows in, shoulders back down again to the top. Stage two. Now, from there, you get switch things up a little bit and do an inverted or a barbell rope with some chains. Okay? Come off here. This story gets into a little bit of the theory of speed training, but we'll talk about that in a minute. Okay? Now, if you don't have access to chains and things like that, what you can do is go back to the rings with a weight vest. Okay? So this one here is fairly light, it's only about 10 pounds, but they go all the way up to 100 times. So you can work off whatever weight you really choose. Again, it's like the same pull pattern we worked on before, just a little more weight. at the gym, you can do this all at home. With band, fairly inexpensive to get. Just gonna hook your knee in here. Right. And this is gonna help get you out of the hole at the bottom, the initial hardest part of this pull. Okay? Down, all the way from the hand. Okay? So just gonna take away some of those effects of gravity. Body now. Finally, our last stage is just your body weight pull up. Okay? Down. Okay, there you have it. The linear progression on pull ups. Uh, how do I know how many sets reps of each to do? It's actually we're going to consult Prelopin's chart. You guys who don't know who Prelopin was, he's sort of the mad scientist of strength training. Um, he can be found at the Elite FTS website, right? So, program all your pulls into Prelopin's chart. That should give you a good idea of where to start from. Okay, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Cheers.